Hello, it's Tavi, and as you know, I'm a sophomore going into Cornell University, so I thought that I'd share a few tips that I've learned from my freshman year of school. Things I wish I did and things that I also did do to make it a very successful year. Alright, so let's get started. Alright, so the first thing is Google Calendar is your best friend. I did not use Google Calendar my first semester, and it was a hot mess. <laughs> so I highly recommend downloading it for your first semester and putting in your classes make th makes things a lot easier and you a lot less stressed. Number two, I suggest that you take your classes very seriously starting your first semester. The GP your GPA isn't everything, but it definitely is important. If you need to take, if you need help, go to office hours. If you can, do it every week. I also highly recommend studying with people that know what they're doing so that um, if you have any questions, you can just ask them directly instead of stressing out and then forgetting about it later. My third um, tip and trick is to take full advantage of your library. Our libraries are amazing, so I highly recommend using them. They have books and laptops and librarians who know help, who can help you write your papers. Um, you can also borrow equipment for any things that you need. Um, you can also borrow books from outside of schools or from other schools. I know the Ivy Leagues has a borrow direct system that lets you borrow books from other Ivies for free, of course. And these can also include textbooks you might need for class. I did it for one class, it was free, and I loved it. I highly recommend you do it for your other classes. Um, my fourth tip is to take fun classes. And not just fun classes, but take fun classes in your that fulfill your major requirements. I'm in the Arts and Sciences, so we have a lot of fun classes available. I took um, a Cleopatra class this semester, and it was amazing. It helped boost my GPA, because GPA is important, and it also I also learned a lot. It's also a really great stress reliever from your more difficult and strenuous classes. Um, number five, if you're gonna do a language, I highly recommend doing it your first semester because you actually can't do it your, start your second semester. So if you're gonna do a language, start your first semester. I wish I knew that for your above, but I'm doing it next year, so it's okay. <laughs> um, number six, um, meet a lot of people. People are amazing. You're going to need connections. So meet them, write down their names, write down the numbers. Um, if you can, here's what I did during my first year. Um, I would write down descriptions of where I met the person and also associate their names with other places and stuff so that it's easier to remember it, other names and places. So for instance, my name is Tammy. You can use Tammy, or as I usually say, my name is Amy with a T, which helps people to remember it much better. Number seven, be smart with your room DIY. Room, de or room decoration um, de room decoration can get very expensive really quickly. So what I did was I made a lot of my own decorations. I saved a lot of time, a lot of money, and my name, wait, not my name, <laughs> and um, my room was actually really pretty. So I'll do future videos of doing, showing what I did, what I will do for my new year, my new bedroom this year. And it'll be really pretty, just you wait. Okay, so number eight, I highly recommend you use your meal swipes. Um, I use a 10 meal swipe plan. I was able to, and I didn't use them all my first first year, which I kind of regret because I was paying for it. So I recommend that you um, use everything. Also, BRBs. BRBs are big red bucks, which is a type of um, credit that you have, or it's money that you can use outside of the dining room, um, dining halls to pay for your food. So make sure you take you budget those because if, it's not fun to start using your debit card to pay for your food midway through the semester <laughs> because it gets really expensive. Cornell's food is really expensive, so budget your meal, your BRBs. I think that it's about $25 per week if you budget them right. I did not budget them right. I ran out early, so don't be like me. Learn from my mistakes. Budget your BRBs. Okay, so number nine is to be smart about your winter clothes shopping. Let's face it, Cornell is freezing. It's a beautiful wonderland when it's you know, warm and happy, but it's a frozen tundra when it's cold. So I, I, I recommend that you gear up with really warm clothes. I use um, Uniqlo um, thermal underwear. I also use um, L.L. Bean. I use their coat, which is really cute. It's like a parka. I also use Sorrel Rain Boots. You're going to need these heavy-duty winter weather clothes for you to last our really long winters. Mm -hmm. Alright, so number 10. Um, I recommend that you schedule an 
um, bi-weekly appointments with your advisor. Um, I remember somebody told me do, to do this during my first semester and I, I'm so glad I did because I really I ended up loving my advisor and it's nice to have somebody who knows what they're doing to direct you in your path through freshman year. Yeah, it's really nice. <laughs> they, also give you, they also help reach out to teachers when you need help or tell you, give you some advice on how to, you know, do your classes too, which helped me a lot. Um, number 11 is to explore Ithaca. Ithaca now is so pretty and Ithaca is beautiful. We have waterfalls and, and so many places to eat and stuff. I, and also museums, I highly recommend you go and visit all these places in your free time because you, the worst thing ever is to graduate Cornell without saying that I explored it without exploring Ithaca. So do it especially with friends. Really great memories, really great memories. And last but not least is your friends. Surround yourself with people who love you um, and encourage you because let's face it, you're gonna cry because school's hard and life is hard but when you have somebody that's, that loves you who can encourage you it's the best feeling in the world so do that and you'll be really happy at Cornell all right so those are my tips and tricks thank you so much for watching um, subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in the future goodbye thank you <laughs>